everybody. I'm Emily. My name's Isley. And today we're going to show you how to start seeds in an egg container. The first thing you want to do is cut off the lid. And this is perfect because then it becomes a tray. And the material this is made out of it's compostable and biodegradable. So once your seedlings start to grow, you can cut these out and you can plant it directly into your garden or into your pot. The next thing you wanna do is you wanna have wet soil. You want it to be moist so it's a good place for the seeds to start germinating. So Isley is going to stir our soil without ace in the way. And we want it to get all mixed up evenly so it's like a, a cookie dough or a batter. While she's doing that, something else you want to do with your egg carton is use something sharp like a screwdriver and you want to poke holes in the bottom of your egg carton. This allows for drainage for your seeds. We've got a special helper today. it all straight up, sweetheart. Next so now we've got holes poked into our egg carton and our soil is moist and all mixed up. So now we're going to put the soil into our carton. We're going to use a scoop. You can use a shovel. You can use whatever you want. We like to recycle and reuse things in different ways. Help me pat it down. Well, you can finish okay. it. You want to make sure that the soil is padded down nice and firm so there's not too many air pockets in there so it's a nice place for your seeds to germinate. For the smaller seeds it's about a quarter inch so you want to take something sharp like another screwdriver or a pencil and you can just poke a little hole in the middle of each one. You want to make sure you don't poke it too deep or the seed won't germinate. Next thing, we're going to get out our magic seed box. This is a special box we got when we lived in Washington and we've used it to keep our seeds in ever since.
today we're going to be starting cilantro, spinach, black seeded lettuce, and kale. If you didn't notice, these are all green. And something that is important to do when you start seeds is to label what you planted. This is from this past year. We've got these nice little sticks. We just wrote on them. Spinach, lettuce, kale, and cilantro. It's also good to do something in a notebook or journal to keep track of when you started your seeds so you have an idea of when they'll be ready to move from your indoors to your outdoor garden. So the kale seeds, and with most of our seeds, we like to put about two in each one instead of just one. So if seed fails to germinate, we at least have one thing growing still. Two things growing, you can later thin them out or take them away. So you wanna take two seeds, put them in the hole, in here. Oh, I asked, that's fine. Put two in here. Once your seeds are in, you just want to put a little soil on top and pat it down gently. And then we'll continue with the rest. So next we have our spinach. These are bigger, right? Yeah. Finally, cilantro. <laughs> All right, now open the seed box. Put the lid on. So we've got all of our seeds Oopsies. planted and we're going to be moving them indoors and in the next three to four weeks we'll see how it goes.